Hello and welcome back to Hearthstone. My name's Lumen and right now it's time to jump back into the Tavern Brawl. Time for another crack at Heart of the Sunwell. Now I want to go in with Paladin again. I deleted the previous deck that I had because it was terrible. I want to make something slightly more effective. I do not know what that entails. But I think I need a slightly better mix. Definitely gonna want two of those. I didn't actually want that. I'm going to want card draw. I do like how Blessed Champion works. Holy Wrath? Uh, no. I'm not going to do that. I could go for a Dragon Paladin. This could finally be Dragon Paladin's chance to shine. Because you start with 10 mana. I like Guardian of Kings. I do, however, prefer some of the legendaries that I've got. Damn, like, what do I do? Uh, do I want any of these? No, let's go legendary first, okay? Probably gonna end up putting most of the same stuff in here, but... I think Master Overspark was actually a bad idea. I don't know what I was thinking with that. Let's go Fugan Stalag. Definitely Thoris, and I'm going to leave Hogger out this time. Sylvanas can go in. No. Yes. Yes. No, this doesn't work well with Paladin at all. Nefarian. Uh, Yasera. Thermoplug is just a really solid turn one play. But, eh. It's not a turn one play, it's not a good play. In my opinion, at least. Now I want to put some silence in and. Oh! Anoyotrons. I actually think Anoyotron could be like the dark horse of this brawl. Silence. Just because. Everyone's gonna be playing these 12 12 death wings or whatever. Then you just pop down an Anoyotron. What are they gonna do? Nothing. There is nothing that they can do. Should we go Lomobot? I want to have some fun. I, I think a Lomobot could help me have some fun. Now, it removes some of the on-play effects, but it's just really good. Let's put one of those in. Another silence, maybe, in the form of a Spellbreaker. And we have one more space. Sludge Belcher, right? Right. Okay, something needs to go. I'm just not sure what. One peacekeeper. Two peacekeepers. Uh annoy your trons. <laughs> I was just Oh, I was just speaking so highly of them. But what no oh. Sky Golem's good. Sky Golem is really good. Force Tank Max is actually also really good. Uh, as are these. I don't know. Such a tough choice that I'm left with here. How to fill these last two slots? Hmm. Faceless? Faceless seems bad, just because, like, it's not going to help you win. It's just going to maybe put you on the same level as your opponent, and then what is that going to help? So let's throw another silence in there. Uh, oh, we got okay, we got the two. Never mind, two silences enough. I'm going to go to Paladin cards, and I want to toss. Do we have any removal at all? Okay, we're going to keep the two peacekeepers. Or. Let's go with Hammer of Wrath. It's a good way to cycle, isn't it? I'm trying to make something slightly better, but I feel like I'm ending up with something that's much the same. Peacekeeper needs to go. I keep looking there and thinking it's not going to help. So instead of Peacekeeper, we can put in more stuff like Noble Sacrifice, for instance, that'll block their attacks. 
Maybe eye for an eye. Come, maybe this will finally be useful. Let's try that. This could be absolutely disgustingly terrible. No, not eye for an eye. Eye for an eye needs to go. I'm being incredibly indecisive here, but it's it's how great decks are born. Like this. This is how. I suppose. Guardian of Kings. No, legendaries. Legendary. Back to the legendaries. Bulvar? I like Bulvar. Mukla. Uh, Mukla? He's a big body for very little and. Uh, no. Not Mukla. Maybe Mecha Talk. He makes games fun, right? Or Illidan. Or Toshli. I do like me some Toshli. That's it. We're going to that. I'm putting Toshli in because he is slightly cheaper. And I think the spare parts could come in handy to just fill the gaps between all the massive legendaries. I'm always left with like one or two or three mana. Spare part could solve that for me. Although, I would miss out on, say, his on-play effect if I had used the Alomobot. I don't know. I must protect Druid. The well, this Toshli. I will fight with honor. I want to keep Toshli. He gives you something the second you play him, and he's also not that easy to remove. Show them no Reporting for duty. Nice. I could attack something now in return. It's nice. One of my favorite legendaries, actually, but then he, oh, he ends up being so terrible. Okay, well, this is a, a really early use of Big Game Hunter, unfortunately. It's gonna have to happen, though. Oh. Well, yeah, okay. Reporting for duty. Here we are. Oh, no! I should have returned the big game hunter immediately. Look, I don't expect him to kill it right now, but I, sh I shall return it. Oh, now I can get an attack in and then return it. That actually makes a lot of sense, so I'm not gonna punish myself about that just yet. Well, now I'm not returning it at all. My god. This is a pretty neat kill for Toshli. Silence. Belcher. Let me think. You know what? I. If I silence. Yeah, okay, so I can silence that, but I think I should save the silence. There's no point, right? So I'd rather put that there and that there. Yes, okay. And then attack face. Okay, this is what, I, this is what I'm doing. I like this. Attack face. Return this to my hand. And summon another one of these. Cool. Like, that's perfect. Now, he runs his Lotheb into my secret. And all is well in the world once more. I guess. But being able to reuse the big game hunter, that's great. Now <laughs> he knows I've got a big game hunter. Oh, but he's check- okay, okay, he's checking first for secret. Well done. Get down! Oh, he's gonna Alex- no, he can't Alex Rosa, it's nine. My shield for Argus! But now it's not gonna die! That was boo-boo. I think that was a boo-boo. Now it's either... Harvesting servos or... Dr. Boom. 
or Belcher? Let's go Harvesting Servers. No, or Dr. Boom. Five, six. That's six damage right there. I wonder. Yeah, let's go. Let's go Boom. And I could even freeze this. I'm doing it. Because then it's even more difficult for him to actually kill Boom. It seems like overkill, but I want him to struggle with Boom like a whole lot. And then I play another big one. And then he's like, whoa. Okay. Oh, Boom. Why are you so good? Oh. My. God. It comes. I've got the beast in my side. That's gotta hurt. 14 damage. Man, oh man, oh man. Blessed champion. So good. Well played. Thank you. Ah, uh, it's exactly six, so uh, he knows he's dead. Oh, shame, but look at that card that he's playing. I, oh, I'm paid to win in here. He did good. Okay, he did good. I mean, I should have known with the Ironbark protectors and stuff. I feel bad. I feel like a really bad person. And I didn't get to use the poor little Alamo bots. We go again. Hopefully we'll get them. In the opening hand. I want to throw out two Alamo bots and then have like two big legendaries in my hand. That would be the ideal. Is it possible? Yes, of course it is. If I go first, then I'd want the two, plus I'd draw into another big legendary. Oh, this is going to be so good. Another Malfurion. Oh, that's nice to have. That's really good to... Oh, okay, this is all pretty good. I might drop KT. Okay, we're dropping KT. And we're picking up Alexstrasza. That could potentially be even better than Nefarian to start with. Huh. Look, I I think I start with Nefarian, and then I have Alexstrasza on the turn after that. Where shall I start? Snakes. It has to be snakes. Okay. I was about to say, where do I even begin? Put your faith in the light. Reporting for duty. I hope this is gonna work. <sighs> That's such an intimidating start. Okay, well that's fine. For justice, I can't do the battle. Like, do I want to silence the eight-eight taunter? Uh, not really. Let's see if he's as smart as the previous one. Let's see if he shapeshifts before. Yeah, now I think I might even silence. I have no time for games. Your magic shall not save me. I think I'm just gonna go straight face with everything. Justice. 
Thing is, I can kill that now. But I'm taking so much damage. Myself. I can put this there, along with... Ah, oh, there's no good way of doing this, is there? Wait, there must be a good way of doing this. So, if I... Must move quickly. I wonder... It's six to face. For justice. The battle. Not amazing. Not amazing. I mean, I'm down on 16. But that's, that's actually the ideal for me. That's what I wanted. Okay, I'm fine. I'm still okay. I'm still in it. Fortunately. Shall I put the panic bot down? I don't think I can. Give me wrath. Give. Me. Wrath. Druid. Wild is mine to control. That's actually pretty useful. Okay. Um. This is good. This is very good. <laughs> Wait, is it? Ah, <laughs> uh, no. I'm gonna have to waste Sylvanas. I'm gonna have to waste Sylvanas. Or not. Alternatively, I could just... I'm wasting Sylvanas. Oh, I'm getting it. Right. Right. I forget. I'm not actually wasting Sylvanas. This is going to be a sick swipe from him. Oh, is he going to attack into this? Oh, dude. Ooh. Oh! <laughs> it sounds... Sorry. I can't help it. Uh, cool. Alex Straza is coming into play if he doesn't kill the Alamo bot. So much fun. I, again, do feel kind of bad because I see a lot of people here who don't have all the legendaries and stuff. That's just the way of things, and some of them are making it work. This guy could have easily beaten me. I can see. He's, he could still have beaten me right now if he just had combo in his hand. Pretty great. So this uh, Tavern Brawl definitely gets a big thumbs up from me. I'm gonna try Miracle Rogue in the next one because I think that would just be the most fun. Ever. Imagine, for a second, Grim Patron Warrior. Uh, but that won't work, actually. Because if you make a Grim Patron Warrior deck, then you're not gonna have anything to bounce the Grim Patrons off of. Although... You could just completely do away with the Grim Patrons and instead go the old-fashioned Raging Worgen, Rampage, uh, solely reliant on Warsong Commander type deck. That, that could work as well. I want to do that. I'm definitely playing Warrior as well. You heard it here first. Warrior, Rogue, all of it's going to be so much fun. Anyway, check back here soon for that. Give it a like, share it, and do all your stuff. Most important, though. Happy Brawling the Paladin, again, in the heart of the Sunwell. Happy that. Thank you.